Hello and greetings, Joe Lamine here, and I'm currently riding the XS Express en route to Roboport. So yeah, it's gonna take three days for the XS Express to reach Roboport as usual, and plus there's that stop at Riverside Station where hopefully nothing goes wrong. Until we get there, I'd like to talk to you about a few things. I don't know how many of you have seen my video about Super Mario 64. I've got a similar video about the original Paper Mario from the Nintendo 64 on the way, but there have been some complications with that, so I'm hoping you guys understand. And for those of you who don't know, I am now currently on Patreon, so go check me out there. I now want to talk to you about Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Now, you would expect me to make a big video for that too, but that's gonna take a lot of time, so I'd rather just make a bunch of smaller ones, including this one. Ever since it was announced, fans have been really excited for this remake. After three lackluster entries, we finally get something good, and today's generation of Paper Mario fans actually get to experience quality Paper Mario. And after Nintendo gave us SMB Wonder and the Mario RPG remake, it's really not surprising that Nintendo would listen to their fans and actually start giving us good games again. They finally bring back a good Paper Mario game! It has not been easy for me keeping up with the hype. I even went through what some people call fear of missing out with this, but you know what? Now I like the energy! Now I embrace it! Now I welcome it! A treasure map? A treasure map? A treasure map? Let the tale begin! Yeah, I know how it goes, game! Everything's made of Stupid narrator doesn't know any better! Of course everything's made of paper, isn't that obvious? Damn it, don't you have anything new to tell me about? Your humor is paper thin! Partner up with Goombella. And okay, yeah, I know who Goombella is! The shy yet determined Coops. He's Cooper, but disabled. And the rather dramatic Madame Fleury. Nintendo's not gonna get any more provocative than that. Don't you have anything new to tell me, game? Stupid narrator. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Don't you have anything new to tell me? Anything at all? Most moves require doing an action command. Ooh, really? I didn't know what an action command? What's an action command? What's an action command? I want to know what an action command is! I know what an action command is! Impress the audience to earn star power. I give up. Roll up to the Oh, look at that! They replaced gambling with with gambling! They replaced gambling with gambling! Today's generation of Paper Mario fans still get to gamble! Listen, narrator, we are excited for this game, but we're not that excited! Who am I kidding? Of course we're, we're that excited. But you're talking to me like I've never played the game before! Nintendo was even nice enough to animate the opening for us! Spoiler alert! It's a trash room! Alright, so besides the typical quality of life updates, we get a lot of new things in this game. For instance, the fast travel system is better. No more stupid backtracking! In your face, you stupid white goose! Also, the mailbox SP system is better. I can't move because I got a new email. I hope I can exchange 9,999 coins for 3,333 Bianta tokens all at the same time. Let's hope Nintendo updates the game so it runs at 60 frames per second, not 30. And what about Luigi? Do we get to see more of the Waffle Kingdom? A paper Luigi DLC would be nice. Okay, I'm done. So yeah, that's how excited I am for this new game, and I'm pretty sure lots of you are too these past eight months. We get there when we get there. This has been Joe Lameme. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. And don't forget to check out my Patreon, and don't forget to subscribe if you want more Joe Lameme content. Goodbye!